so good morning good morning welcome to pretty good coffee you know what i'm gonna tell you to do before we actually get started that is to stop what you're doing press the subscribe button hit the notification bell so you're always notified when a new video goes up and then i want you to get your coffee and get your word and let's get started So guys, I am racing to work. Racing, 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 racing to work. Um, but I wanted to get our pretty good coffee in um, because today is a very, very full day for me. It is absolutely the way the week this is going to be. Um, and I have the perfect scripture the perfect scripture for it um, but before I tell you about the scripture I'm gonna tell you about my coffee um, today I am drinking uh, La Colombe um, again it's really good uh, this time it is in the yellow bottle it is strictly medium roast um, it's really good I have the planet oat vanilla oat milk um, and the Chobani uh, vanilla oat creamer yes that's what I have. It's it's the vanilla and it's the oat creamer, um, and it's really really good, really good. Um, I still have not found a creamer to top Chobani for me. Like, I found really good creamers, as y'all know, and they're very good, and I like them a lot. But there's something about Chobani for me, so I hope that they come out with some other flavors. Um, and I'd love to try them. So Chobani, if you're listening, I would love to be a taste tester for you. Uh, <laughs> But um, but I do. I I'm. They're still at the top for me. They're still at the top for me. Um. So, anyways, done that. Said it. Now let's talk about the word. So we're doing Psalms, um, one nineteen, verse one eighteen. So Psalms. If I can get y'all to focus, <laughs> like this camera is doing the most. I really just need like a better stand, y'all. I really do. I really really do. Uh. No 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 no. Hold on, this car is like stopping. Nope, you have to stay there. Okay, perfect. All right, so Psalms 119, verse 118. I'm gonna read the uh, CSB version, of course. Um, I'm just watching the traffic, guys. Because I know that y'all want me to survive. Okay. <clears throat> here we go I'm in position now I am in position you are my shelter and my shield I put my hope in your word you are my shelter and my shield I put my hope in your word that's Psalms 119 verse 118 CSB version and I thought that this was perfect because again I have a lot of things going on my family has a lot of things going on some good so not so great um, and some things that just require a lot of work right so it's not good or bad it's just a lot of work um, and when it gets easy for my mind to get overwhelmed or anxious or for me to um, get to those ways of I have to calculate uh, every possible outcome and scenario because I'm getting nervous um, or having to tap in into things that I normally just would be like, you know what, no. Um, I'm reminded in this that he's my shelter and he's my shield and I put my hope in his word. And it's important because it's shelter and shield. So it's covering and it's protection right so the literal onslaught the attacks of the depression the anxiety the overwhelm i have a shield against that those darts are not going to hit me but it's also my shelter and that is covering and so the things that are raining down that are causing me to not be as focused because my vision is is blurry because of the rain or the hail or whatever it is or 
um, to feel like I have to take on everything by myself. There's covering for that. There is support for me. There is provision for me. Uh, but most importantly, I put my hope in his word. So I don't have to calculate every scenario. I don't have to get everything right. There is this reality that my hope is in his word and in the promises that he's already made because he keeps his promises. My hope is in his word and so when i'm getting anxious and i'm getting overwhelmed or i'm feeling depressed or i'm feeling like oh my god i gotta figure this out like right now like my timeline is running out i go back i go back and it says you put your hope in the word so go back to the word what does it say what are the promises that he made to you what is the mandate that he gave you to actually focus on and not this extra stuff that you decided to take on like those are things that matter i put my hope in his word I'm not putting my hope in myself and my own ability. I'm not putting it in anyone else's. I'm not letting um, the lawyers or the doctors make the decisions without consulting God. I put my hope in his word. And because I do that, then the shield and the shelter, they're activated. The shield and the shelter are activated because my hope is in his word. That means that I'm applying the word as the shield and as the shelter as the shield and as the shelter it makes the most sense you combat the enemy you combat your flesh you combat your mind with the provision and the truth of god's word and when you do that the shield and the shelter that you have already been promised they've been activated <laughs> isn't that good i know i know i know i know i know it was my same my same exact reaction same exact reaction i was like i hear you god be dope then be dope i love it i love it i love it i love it i also love that i'm actually not gonna be late to work let me tell you let me tell you doing these pretty good coffees with y'all you get me extra favor and blessings <laughs> it does it does it does it does so i am very thankful thank you god thank you um, cause I had to jump on a weekly meeting, um, very soon. So, but I'm going to make it. I'm going to actually be actually a little early. So, he's my shelter and my shield. I put my hope in his word. Okay. That's good. That's good. Well, I want you to hold Psalms 119 verse 118 in your heart. I'm sorry for all the bumps. Y'all already know how it is when I'm going to work. They need to fix these streets without upping my tax dollars. So, there's that. But that that's it. So, I want you to hold Psalms 119, 118 in your heart. Be prepared for a productive, a beautiful, and effective, and efficient week. Because God has promised you that you can have that. He has promised you that you can have that. And make sure that you get your fill of pretty good coffee, caffeine, water, juice, whatever it is that you love, and, and let it be a good jump start to your week. And then get your tickets to the Hey Pretty Conference at heyprettylife.com. And remember, if you're needing some help in getting your tickets, email petroblog16, that's the number 16, at gmail.com, and the team will be happy to work with you. Because we want all the girls in the room I've just made the decision. We want all the girls in the room that God has destined for the experience. And if we can help you do that, we want to do it. So email us and we're going to get it done. All right. I will see you soon. Have a good week, pretty. Bye.